Why would my species expose their brains through a glass dome? The species I have created looks eerily human-like, practically indistinguishable from human except for a reptile-like tail and an exposed brain. The top portion of the skull is replaced with a glass-like dome, which exposes the brain. The species I created lives on a planet filled with diseases and bacteria that primarily affect the brain, sometimes the physical structure of it but, other times, just the behavior. The glass dome is connected to the skin by a small metal-like ring that glows slightly in the dark. My question is, is what purpose or advantage would my species have by exposing the brain in a glass dome? Enter image description here. For reference, this is what I mean by glass dome, which in the image, the brain is exposed from under the glass dome. Edit. The glass dome on my species' heads aren't natural, and are surgically added to the head. There doesn't need to be any advantage. Your species simply thinks it is aesthetically pleasing. Look at human history. We do all sorts of strange things in the pursuit of beauty. Depending on the culture we may mutilate our genitalia, ears, feet, neck, and even forehead in order to be more appealing for a wide range of reasons. Most commonly to attract the opposite sex though it doesn't always need to be for this reason. Sometimes we do it out of sheer tradition even long after the point where nobody remembers why we started doing it to begin with. So to answer your question? It is a cultural practice. Perhaps your species highly values their minds and have taken to showing off the brain in the most direct and literal way possible, so long as they are advanced enough to perform the procedure without a high risk to the individual undergoing the process there wouldn't be a real barrier to it becoming a widely done cosmetic surgery. If it is connected to some form of religious concept it could even be ubiquitous for any individual who reaches a certain age to have it done. 